So yesterday morning I did my little local 5k race here on the Gold Coast Australia, got another second, I've won that race 13 times, and now I've come second place three times. So 13 wins, three seconds. After the race, I said to Free, I said, I want you to take me to Mount Warning, which is about 50k away, so we jumped in the car and went down there. Mount Warning is one of the highest peaks in Australia, over 3,000 feet. And I said, I'm going to set the fucking record up here. I'm going to fucking light this climb on fire. So I put the GPS watch on. Don't have it with me, but I put a little Garmin watch on. Ran to the top, ran to the summit. Did a 36.54. I originally said, yes, so the 38.21. But when I got the data back home on the Strava.com website, it's a 36.54. Lit the fucking climb up over three minutes faster than the current record there. So on the way down... Um, Almost at the bottom, someone was saying to me, you know, like, oh, you, did you just run up here or something? Like, we saw you up the top and that, and I'm like, yeah, I ran up and down. They're like, well, are you a vegan, are you? I'm like, yeah, I've got the go vegan thing on. And they're like, well, where do you get your protein from? You won't get enough protein if you're a vegan. I'm like, interesting. Really? Tell me more. <laughs> And they're like, yeah, but you know, you're like, what do you do for protein powders and stuff? What do you do for protein? I'm like, don't know. <laughs> don't know, but I just fucking ran up here in record time. <laughs> I just ran to the top of this mountain. Ran. Passing people. I was running so fast up Mount Warning yesterday. People were just like, they'd see me coming up and they'd be like deers in headlights just going, like they just sort of stand in the middle of a path by not knowing what to do. <laughs> like they're just like, what's he running? What? I was running so fast, people started to panic. They're like, they just didn't know what was going on. You know, like they couldn't comprehend. Like they almost couldn't see me because they didn't have the insight that someone could run up the mountain so fast. They're just like, you know, sort of you just caught by surprise. And this person's like, you don't get enough protein. I'm like, really? Tell me more. Because it's so funny, isn't it, when people say you won't get enough protein, minerals, blah, blah, blah. But then you click on their website and they're selling minerals. They're selling digestive enzymes. They're selling can't eat a cleansers, they're selling this, blah, 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 blah. They're selling that, you know. I know David Wolf will go around talking, oh, fruit and vegetables, not enough minerals, buy this. Don't eat that diet, but eat this diet, whichever, I don't know what it is, but, and then buy this mineral supplement you know, from the pyramids in Egypt or whatever, and then you go to Mark Sisson's website and say, oh, vegans don't get enough protein, so you need to eat meat, and buy my little pro primal prey protein, meow meow protein, bro science powder, and that's just hilarious. Then you'll see Rob Wolf and say, oh, a vegan's like enough omega-3s. And then it'll be like a link to some omega-3 supplement somewhere. And it's like, hang on, like, <laughs> yeah, you guys is contradicting what you're saying. It's like, uh, herp derp. And then you go to do like some like twin muscle workout on YouTube and they'll be like, you know, you don't get enough protein if you're a vegan. So I'm not a vegan because I wouldn't get enough protein and I take my whey protein supplement and there's a link down below you can click in the description you can buy it yourself but don't eat vegan because you won't get enough protein so click down below and buy my protein powder <laughs> I was like what? Then you have people oh, I didn't have enough energy on vegan diet and, they're, and they're, they're telling you this while they're drinking coffee <laughs> they're telling you this while they're drinking Red Bull oh, I was a vegan but I didn't have enough energy can you pass me the Red Bull? <laughs> I was like what? Or the people say oh I was a vegan I got really fat and I was like you're still fucking fat now well, what? <laughs> So you just got to laugh at the blatant contradictions people have out there, don't you? Like, but if you're a noob, I can understand it can be confusing because you don't know the, the tricks of the marketing game yet. You're just a noob just walking in going, oh, wow. But once you know what's behind the curtain, what, you know, once you know what Toto's got behind the curtain, you go, oh, that's, you know, the, the, that's, that's obvious. And you can start to see how the... The clever marketing tactics work and it's, it's fun watching that it's fun watching the human behavior the marketing behavior the contradictions but people are so they're so noobs it's like when i work in the bike industry people will come in and go oh that bike's really expensive it must be really good and i'm like well, that's a piece of shit because the warranty is only one year or two years in the frame don't buy that bike spend half the money buy this bike from trek or candale giant or specialized with the lifetime warranty and you're getting a better bike it's got better engineering because it's got a better warranty obviously no, no, but this one's got better price tag on it. It's like... So the money is to be made on the noobs out there. I thought I'd just share a sort of rant, nothing personal against anyone, not to anyone in particular, just across the board, where to get your protein from, zinc, B12, iron, selenium, beta alatine, blah, 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 creatine. It's just like a, a supplement vomit. <laughs> you can just spew it all over your computer. Hilarious stuff. 
post your comments and questions down below what was the last product someone tried to sell you today? And ask people, if your diet prescription is so natural, how come when I go to your website, there's like a fucking smorgasbord of supplements? If your dietary prescription was so sufficient, how come I have to buy so much shit off you? Ask people the question. Don't be afraid to question what's encouraged. We'll see you next video.